The coolest thing I think about this program is that only can you see the model of the solar system, but it lets you switch back and forth between planetarium modes, so what you're seeing in the sky, and where it is in the solar system right now. So click on the telescope to get to the planetarium or sky view. So this is the sky right now for me, and it is 2.48 in the afternoon, and it's showing me what's in the sky even though the sun is also in the sky. To find things on the plane of our solar system, because all of the objects in our solar system are orbiting on approximately the same plane, or all the planets of our solar system are orbiting on the same plane, I am going to look for the red line on here that is the ecliptic. There it is. And that's the plane of our solar system. This is the horizon. And then this is the plane of the solar system. And you can see that we have Mars, Mars, and Saturn, and all the other planets that you're trying to find in the sky will be found along the plane of our solar system as they orbit the sun. Well, the sun is in my sky right now. And if I want to change the date, I go down to the bottom menu and click on just make sure you saw that. You click on the date and I can change the date to any date and actually any year. You can go ahead and click on August 26 and I can also change the time. If I'm not good at military time then I can drag the hands of the clock to the time I want and I'm gonna do 10 o'clock at night p.m. I'm gonna make sure it says p.m. since this program doesn't show daylight. So this is 10 p.m. August 26th of 2014. Okay, I'm finding the ecliptic, the plane of the solar system, and I can see that at this time at night, Mars and Saturn are in the sky, and so are some comets. Anything below the horizon I won't be able to see right now. Um, things rising and setting in the sky. Um, to, if you're curious about rising and setting, you're going to have to play time forward or back. Just barely forward. There we go. Okay, if this is what the sky looks like at 10 p.m. and I want to see time play forward, there are several ways I can do it. The easiest way is just moving the clock hand. And I can watch as the earth turns. I can watch the sky go by. And things like Saturn and Mars setting on the horizon. So sky going by. And that's because of the earth's rotation on its axis.